A congressman denies sexual harassment allegations. But I can't tell you that there weren't times where I want I struggled to make sure that I was doing the right thing. Tonight, Congressman Pat Meehan defends using taxpayer money to pay a former staffer who accused him of sexual harassment. Eyewitness News reporter David Spunt has the letter at the center of the scandal. Did you sexually harass this former female staffer? No, I did not sexually harass this former female staffer. But Republican Congressman Pat Meehan admits to paying off the former staffer with taxpayer money. She's alleging sexual harassment. Meehan says the two were close and they went out for ice cream last spring. She was talking about the brand new relationship that she had. Uh, I opened the door to something in which I said that you're leaving me is going to hurt in one sense. Meehan used the word soulmate when describing the woman to Eyewitness News. The congressman gave us this handwritten letter. He says he wrote to the former staffer following that ice cream date. Meehan wrote, quote, you are and have been a complete partner to me and you have brought me much happiness. It is a very, very lucky man who might get to be your partner for more of your life, end quote. But Mian is now in the hot seat because of that taxpayer-funded settlement. I wanted her not to walk out of this situation once it got engaged with attorneys in a way that was just going to be uh, harmful. Now the House Ethics Committee in Washington is involved, a group that included Mian as a member until just a few days ago. You were on this ethics committee. You called for this ethics investigation. Do you feel hypocritical in the sense that you were on this committee and you denounced behavior of sexual harassment and sexual assault, and now you're being investigated for this. But if I believe that I sexually harassed somebody, you might say I'm hypocritical. I believe that I was communicating with a friend in a way that was invited, that enabled me to assure that we understood each other and had the ability to continue to support each other and work together. The congressman says he will not resign from office. Instead, he plans to run for election again. I asked if he would pay back that settlement money. He says only if the House Ethics Committee tells him to do so. I spoke to an attorney for the woman who used to work for Mr. Meehan. She says she wants the congressman to stop talking about this issue publicly. Reporting live tonight, David Spunt, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. David, thank you.